It's been an incredible journey in the 15 years I've been here. When I came on staff, Paul Land was, had about 500 people in worship. We've seen growth that went from 500 to now about 2,200 people in church or in worship on a weekly basis. We're really just uh, bulging at the seams with the spiritual growth around here. Uh, it's kind of, I've been telling people, I don't know what's going on. I'm just hanging on and enjoying it. I'm getting to watch the Holy Spirit work in a way that I never have. One of our founding members here, Paul Am, his name was Dorothy Mazouk. And uh, Dorothy had a passion for ministry. And one night she had a vision and, and a dream. She dreamed that there was kids hanging out of the windows here at Paul Ann. Uh, and basically that vision was our children's ministry, from preschool to elementary, was just going to explode as it has. And that vision of kids hanging out the windows has kind of kind of come true, not literally hanging out of windows, but the fact that we are just piling kids into rooms and running out of space has come really true to Dorothy's vision of just uh, families coming to Paul Ann and having an opportunity to reach hundreds, literally hundreds of kids on a weekend. And so we've obviously grown over the years and continue to do so as the church grows. But with that comes the need for more and more space. There's something here at Paul Ann that's great and wonderful, but it's all about God. Uh, you know, he's the one doing all this. It's not any one pastor or any one person or any one family. God has just picked this church to do wonderful things. And at this time, we are now to another point where we need to expand. We've been gone now for three years. And during that time, Paul Ann has been so wonderful for us um, as prayer warriors and as financial supporters. Um, and Paul Ann has really made it possible for us to be overseas long term. Uh, so we're so thankful for that because we know other missionaries who that's not the case for them. It was also really fun for us to come back after three years and see the new things that are going on at Paul Ann, like the Global Cafe. And we look forward to hopefully seeing progress on a new building. And um, yeah, we're just really excited. You know, I moved here three years ago and I kind of felt alone. Even when I wasn't, I felt, I felt really alone sometimes. It was really at my my CLG and through the pains and the people there, they really reached out to me and they were just encouraging and they gave me a family that I didn't necessarily have here. We built a preschool building and we filled that building up. We built a children's building and we added portable buildings and, and all along the way we've just, because of God's blessings, we, we've kind of had to expand our space and, and um, make room for the people that God's brought. and. To me, it's super exciting to see that we are at that point again. So as we expand, as we, we build this new building, obviously we'll have the opportunity to reach more families because we'll have space for their kids, but it also gives us the opportunity to provide a more safe, secure environment for those kids. We'll be in a facility that uh, is really locked down to the outside. If you're not a parent, if you're not a volunteer, you wouldn't be allowed back. And so it really puts up these parameters of security and safety in place. And so having that opportunity to up our game in the field of security is going to be, going to be huge for us. As I think about Pauline's future, if our past is any indicator of what's to come, to me, it's not about what potential numbers there'll be. It's more about how many more changed lives will there be. I'm so excited about the expansion because I, I tell you, we, when we expand here on campus and we, we, get, a, we get another building uh, to have more ministry involved, we also see an expansion of the kingdom. And the more expansion we have, the more growth we have here, the more people's gonna enter the kingdom. There's no doubt in my mind. We're gonna see more people come to Christ. I'm really just thankful to Paul Ann for having such a heart for people. I think that's genuine here, and I think it's encouraging, and I think that's what that's what gets the gospel out, and that's what changes lives, and that's what reaches those people who who are afraid to step inside of a church. And Paul Ann's not a church that stays inside the doors. As a family, we're really, really excited about it. Can't wait to see what God does as He stretches us one more time and expands our borders, and hopefully, you know, more wonderful things will happen. In a place where people are passionate about Jesus. Um, there is life and it's very apparent here all the way from the nursery up through the CLGs that there is just a God-given fullness of life here 
And when people come and experience that, it, it excites them for the mission, it excites them for the things of God. And so we're really excited for this next season of growth here at Paul Ann as we um, seek to just walk in what he has for us and to believe for more because um, I think if, if he's shown us anything over the course of history here at Paul Ann, it's that there, there is always more to be had. And as we believe for more, he, he provides more and gives more.